hello everyone welcome to my views on news uh, viewers in today's video i will talk about russia ukraine conflict uh, if you follow international conflicts you must have heard the name of uh, crimea donbass luhansk and donetsk uh, all these areas are in ukraine and this conflict is uh, confined to these areas uh, so let's have a look into it uh, Firstly, Ukraine is located in Eastern Europe and it was a part of Soviet Union. In 1991 referendum, more than 90% citizens of Ukraine voted that they want an independence and they got separated from Soviet Union. Uh, Ukraine is located in between Europe and Russia. To the west of Ukraine, it's Europe. To the east of Ukraine, it's Russia. Viewers' conflict started in 2013. Uh, Pro-Russia government in Ukraine had to quit after a mass protest. Uh, in 2014, protesters wanted closer ties with the EU. After that, a pro-EU president came into power. Then Russia decided to intervene and Russia sent their forces in Crimea secretly. Uh, military vehicles without any official marking uh, uh, and referendum held in Crimea. Uh, in the referendum, more than 95 percent uh, people of Crimea voted in the support of uh, Russia and uh, Russia annexed Crimea. If you talk about strategic location of Crimea, it's very important. Uh, uh, if you have a control on uh, Crimea, you have an easy access uh, to Europe, Turkey, and Russia. Viewers, apart from Crimea, conflict started in two cities of uh, Donbas region, Luhansk and Donetsk. Separatists in Luhansk uh, proclaimed this as Luhansk People's Republic and the separatists in Donetsk uh, uh, proclaimed this as uh, Donetsk People's Republic, also known as LPR and uh, DPR. Uh, these separatists are backed by Russia and they are fighting against Ukrainian forces. Uh, international community does not recognize uh, LPR and DPR uh, and also uh, does not recognize uh, Crimea as part of Russia. If you talk about the current situation, uh, uh, despite 2015 security agreement, uh, on and off fighting is going on uh, in Luhansk and Donetsk. Um, viewers, I will keep you updated on this. Uh, thank you for watching.